Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to G-Bears Off-Grid Ways, a homestead in the desert. And here we are outside on a beautiful day. Temps in the 70s, 70s Fahrenheit that is. Uh, hopefully it's not 70 Celsius. <laughs> You'd see flames around here, right? Anyway, I can't afford to do anything today, so... All I did was uh, play around in the shop here. Hey guys, hey, 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 hey. Quit that wrestling and you guys get angry at each other. So anyway, I had a bunch of uh, buckets and plastic containers and that stuff where um, my guys that worked for me when I had my construction company would clean out the van and a bunch of stuff had uh, like boxes of screws and stuff on the shelves had torn open and they were all mixed together. So instead of sorting them out, when I told them to go clean the van out, they would just clean everything off a shelf and put it in a plastic bucket. <laughs> well, you know, there's probably forty, fifty dollars worth of uh, screws, nuts, bolts, and uh, self-tappers and all that kind of stuff in one bucket and uh, I could I just couldn't throw it out I'm too frugal for that so I just put them all to one side and when I moved out here I just hauled them in and and set them on a floor or on a shelf or whatever so today I saw them and I said you know what I got a little job coming up tomorrow and the next day so I'm going to go out and clean all of those screws up and sort them out. So, that's pretty much what I've been doing all day. I've been sitting here in my little homemade chair. And I got a bunch of them sorted out in here. I got another container like this I just put in the van that's got all them all sorted out. Now these tan ones, they're all the same. But I just had so much of them, um, I had to fill in all those extra little pockets. These tan ones are different. And how? Well, these are Phillips head, and these are actually number three Phillips head. And then these are the stars, or the T uh, torque. T11, I think it is. Um, I don't really like torques, but I can use them uh, when I'm starting to put some of my stuff together. Anyway, I got some uh, some of the blue screws here for concrete. I got I found some four-inch screws there that always come in handy around the homestead. Found some uh, three and a half inch, some uh, two and a half inch, some three inch, and all kinds of uh, stuff sorted out. And then all these tips down here, only two of them, a number one and a number three, are used slightly used all the others here are all brand new so they'll get used hey 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 can't you see i'm trying to shoot a video here just like a bunch of kids i get busy and you guys got to make noise <laughs> the dummies a couple of them on one side of the door a couple on the other side of the door and they're trying to get at each other under the door. Just crazy. Look at that. Anyway, they are a lot of fun to watch sometimes. But they were getting a little too noisy there, so I had to quiet them down. Hey, Limpy, that's enough. Right, Wolfie? You're not chewing my rubber seals on my door, are you? You love rubber and plastic. So anyway, um, I got that stuff done. I did a little work in the garden also. And then I got staring at the chicken coop. Well, I was saying, well, I can get some of the extension done there. I get the uh, baseboards laid into place and I can get it um, infilled so that I don't have critters tunneling up from underneath. But... I got thinking, well, I don't have money to buy chickens, so I don't really need the thing extended now. That's just a waste of time. So I got to do something that's a little bit more prosperous. 
Anyway, I got um, an idea here. I got some items, um, extra items that I don't use anymore. And I was thinking that since I could use some cash, maybe I would, might do a live online auction. And I'll put some items out. And I'll have a, a minimum starting on them. And then uh, everybody can bid on the item that they think that they might like. Like a, uh, you know, maybe a, a nice metal detector or um, some gold pans, things like that. You know, I got a lot of extras that I don't really need. And I, I kept them in case I had guests and they wanted to go prospecting. I'd have an extra for them. But, you know, over the years I've collected a bunch of them. So I've got like five different uh, sizes of pans and I've got five of each size. I don't need that many, so why not turn that into some cash? So I'll auction the items, and um, you will pay the the person who wins the in the auction will pay shipping on it. They're, I'm not going to say shipping and handling because I'm not going to charge you for handling them, but uh, just for shipping, and uh, that means that I, I'll have to do a guesstimate on it because I can't package it up, run it to the post office, have it weighed, come back and tell you how much it is, and then uh, wait for you to pay me and then go down and mail it. So uh, I talked to the guy at the post office, and he said on their website they have an estimator there for the size of the box and um, the weight of the box, and you put that information in, and it'll give you a good idea of what it's going to cost. And I'll send everything... Uh, Unless the person that buys it wants it insured, it'll all be sent just tracking. So you can track the package. But uh, if you want it insured, that'll be an added uh, amount also. So, gotta love it out here. Turbine's not moving. I don't have a flag on my flagpole because the last one got shredded in the last winds. And now they're saying that the rains that are supposed to be here on Friday are very iffy. And if they do show up, it's going to be another one of those little sprinkles. The last rain that they they said we we're going to get Saturday and Sunday and Monday and all that shit. Well, Saturday we got good rain. On uh, Sunday, I got one one hundredth of an inch. That's a... Uh, that's like a quarter of a millimeter for you uh, people out there that are into the metrics. Uh, not very much. So that's about it. I got some water still in that barrel right there. I'm going to hook up a hose to it and uh, just uh, gravity feed it down to the garden when I need to water stuff. But for right now, nothing needs watering because of the rains that we had, everything is... Uh, pretty much uh, drenched and soaked. So I'll uh, get a few more things uh, done here. Maybe I'll get some more soil um, mixed with um, fertilizers and that and get it rejuvenated and get some more pots filled and clean up that pile that's over there. The dogs love playing in it. But... Uh, Glad they don't have to come into the house. They have their outdoor houses. They, come, they get really dirty in there. All right, everybody. I want to thank you all for joining me. This is G-Bear signing off.